This is Line Break. I'm T.D. Walker. On this episode, I'm delighted to be joined by poet Christina M. Rao, who will read three of her poems. Christina M. Rao is the author of What We Do to Make Us Whole, the Elgin Award-winning Liberating the Astronauts, and two poetry chapbooks. She serves as poet-in-residence for Oceanside Library in New York and was 2020 Walt Whitman Birthplace Poet of the Year. Her poetry airs on Destiny's radio show, WUSB, and appears in various literary journals. When she's not writing, she's teaching yoga or watching the Game Show Network. Find her online at christinamrao.com. Too much history here. When did I stop listening to music? Stop singing? Stop swaying? When did I stop replaying one song over and over until I knew all the words? When did I stop knowing all the words, all the songs and all the stations? Eventually, the room fills with mistakes instead, taken away breath by effortful breath. Every shimmer felt hope, a dare untold. It's all old now, all that's unopened stays that way. Too much happened here, and also never enough love. He left, and he left, and he left, and he left. And even when the leaving wasn't him, it was still leaving. Glances at doorways, twisting a neck over a shoulder. No one shows up. The staying unbearable, the keeping impossible. Who moved? Who stuck deep in shadow, came, went? Nothing safe. A space holds open a wanting, a haunting, like the need to crawl out of skin, to not be here, to not exist, but to also be present. All raw nerve. He made me believe. He grabbed my hand. I did it to myself and to him and to both of us. Let the want be more. Let the hurt be real. And that's how it always ends, you know? Hurt. Harm. How we make amends. Hands in dirt blacken, fresh soil deep under nails, burrows into cracks. Fresh soil for planting, but planting season has passed. Now is the time to remain dormant under unsteady sky. Even so, a want to make anew relights a flame more brilliant, an aberration in the cycle. We do our best to outrun, outshine, skip a step around, rain bogging down, ice solidifying over first, with no time to adjust. Nature wins. We hibernate, we wait. That's how we heal, how we find hope. And then, if the hope we have turns into less, we dig our hands in deep, allow scrapes, scrounge in roots, we start again. Woods walk. Keep the river to the left. When you turn, it switches to the right. When crossing the bridge, watch for the current. Drop a leaf in and follow with your eyes. Shoulders back, gaze down, the roots can snag you. Gaze up when you stop. You should stop, sip, and breathe. Look around for signs in case you get lost. You will get lost. When you're tired and ready for home, you will see nothing familiar. When your feet throb, when your back bows, when your body sweats and burns, you won't know which way to forge ahead. Listen for the brook as it falls. Catch a drift of honeysuckle. Feel your own heartbeat and walk. The brush will clear. The river will find you. Keep close to its edge and you will 
برگرد بعد